Hello, and welcome to another exciting tutorial. Today, we will dive into the fascinating world of creating animated GIFs using Google Collab. Let's jump right in and get started. First, head over to the provided GitHub link. The link will be given in the description. Scroll down until you find the Google Collab link for animated GIFs. Click on it, and it will be redirect you to the Google Collab webpage. You can also use the Stable Diffusion install version on the other hand, whichever you prefer. simply click Run for the first cell. After the first cell is done, you will see the second cell right below it. But before moving on, navigate to Files and then Animated GIF, followed by Config and then finally Prompt. Here you will find prompt files sorted with YML extension. Download one of them and open it in. Notepad in the prompt file, you will see multiple prompts written. Feel free to remove others and create your own prompt along with a negative prompt. You can also adjust the seat and other settings as needed. I'll keep the default setting just for the sake of demonstration. Don't forget to save the file. Now drag and drop the file into the prompt section in Google Collab. Remember to rename it, changing its extension from text to YAML. Also ensure that the file name in the command line matches the drag file's name. In prompt section, click run for the second cell. Rendering may take four to five minutes. Head to the samples folder under models. Then locate the folder named after your prompts file along with timestamp detail. Delve further into the folder and double click the file to view your marvelous GIF. Take a moment to admire the quality of the animation. Let's try editing the prompt and following the same procedure. As you can see, the results are fantastic. Save the GIF by right-clicking on it and selecting Save as to begin the download process. For an added twist, you can even run two prompts simultaneously. Here I have used prompts name prompt 3 and prompt 4 and added two command lines to execute them together, while the second prompt is running. You can check out the first one when it's done. Be patient during rendering, especially when running multiple command lines. That's it for the video, and I look forward to catching you in the next one. See ya.